Hey, Mr. Cochran here, actually in the cybersecurity lab. Uh, it's the end of the day. Um, my students just got done with their uh, senior capstone projects. And um, I kind of wanted to show you our little setup that we had uh, for recording. So I brought in some of my personal like recording stuff, uh, hence the camera you're actually watching me on, which is the Sony ZV-1. Um, but I kind of wanted to show you our setup. Uh, this might be useful for some other teachers. Um, yeah, let's dive into it. So uh, in the classroom, I teach uh, cybersecurity uh, here at a local career center. And um, one thing I brought in was I brought in my uh, Rode Wireless Go mics. Uh, so we could use those for students. Um, I try to record these. Um, think of it kind of like a little mini TED Talk. Um, so they get up in front of the class. Uh, we've got our projector set up here, and then they present their, their presentation. So, um, so what we got recently was we actually got a webcam I got for the classroom. Um, it's actually up here, so it's kind of hard to see. Uh, but this is the uh, Insta360 link. And then um, what I do is I have it on a pole, that goes up to the drop ceiling. And then from that, the wireless or the USB, you can kind of see it just goes along the ceiling there. And then it drops down over by my desk. So that's kind of how we get the uh, video into the system. So that's a USB webcam. And then over here, we have our um, kind of down here, our A10 Mini Extreme. And then uh, back there, you can kind of see it. Uh, but we've got the uh, Osbot uh, UVC adapter. So that takes the USB-C webcam uh, from up there. It's actually just right over there. So it takes that webcam video and then converts it over to HDMI, which then goes into the ATEM. So um, if I bring the camera here, so it's going to be a little tricky. I'm going to turn my little monitor around so I can kind of see better. So what we've got is I've got my multi-view here. Um, you can see up on program to, uh, here, I've actually got the webcam actually looking at me. So I'm going to, um, this is going to be a little shaky. I'm sorry. I'm trying to figure out the best way to kind of show you all. So what I've got is I've got my multi-view here from my ATIP Extreme. We've got that uh, link, um, Insta360 link fed in. If I um, actually switch over to that camera, you'll see there's the full view of what that camera sees. So if I look at the Insta360 right now, but the cool thing about this, oops, that's my screen. The cool thing about this Insta360 is if I give it a raise hand, now you're going to see, did you see that camera move? It moved ever so slightly. So now what that camera is actually going to do is it's going to actually track me. So let me, um, let me switch over so you can get a full screen view. So actually that camera, that webcam now is actually zoomed in on my face and it's going to follow me around in the classroom. So as my students were up here presenting, they would stand here and present their presentation and it's actually doing the auto zoom. So I have it to like do the, I think it's considered half body. Um, so it's actually keeping the, this portion of my body in the frame. Um, but what's really cool is if students move around, it, you know, as they would do their presentation, they might get a little nervous, they move back and forth, whatever. Um, it keeps them in frame and it makes it look like we actually have uh, somebody running a camera operator. And again, this is running through that um, UVC to HDMI, which then feeds it into the ATEM. And then the ATEM I have um, set up here, if I go to our program view. Um, so this would be like their slide deck here is what would show up. And then over here is that camera um, from the, the Link 360. And then I had our school branding uh, down in this corner. I actually removed it for this video. And then down here, we have our just our cybersecurity logo. So it, it, it turned out really cool. I was really, um, I'm really happy with how it all turned out. Um, I think it, it worked out great. I'm really excited for the videos for my students. Um, so hopefully they'll uh, let me share some of those on our uh, Facebook page. Uh, so those might come out in the social media, but I don't know. I think, uh, you know, this little webcam, it's pretty nice. Um, and then we use the Rode Wireless Go mics to get a little better audio. That would work in a pinch as a webcam, but for nice quality audio, um, you, you can't beat having the Rode Wireless. So anyways, hopefully that uh, might find some of that useful. Um, I really like the Insta360 because also up on the whiteboard, I've got these... Um, the Insta360 tags. So these little tags um, let it zoom into the whiteboard. And then what I did is I just took the tags and stuck them to like uh, magnetic like business card holders. So then I made each tag um, basically a magnet that I can move around. But anyways, it's got four of those in each of the corners. And then when you give the Insta360 a peace sign, 
um, it'll actually zoom into the whiteboard and lock onto that instead of onto you. So, and if, it's funny because if you look back here, the uh, Insta360 has been tracking me this whole time. It's still actually set up in tracking mode. So yeah, hopefully you might like this. I apologize for a little bit of the shaky video, but um, I didn't know any better way to kind of show you all of what that looks like. So hopefully you like that. I'm Eli the electronics guy or now Eli the teacher guy today. So hopefully you like it. Have a good day. See y'all.